Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpo Gaming and another Hogwarts Legacy video. Today we have a really cool one for you. We're going to learn Crucio, one of the unforgivable sins, and I'm going to show you how you can unlock it and get it today. Let's go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody, and without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's learn this unforgivable sin. Now, a lot of people may be confused how you can get this started. You're going to receive a message from Sebastian. Now, as long as you are following his storyline, you're going to eventually get that message. And this quest called In the Shadow of the Study. So, just continue to progress the story and his quest line. Eventually, this will pop up. But if it doesn't, make sure you check your owl notes and then you'll get this quest. From there, you want to head over and speak with Sebastian in the Ravenclaw Tower. So that's what we want to do. We're going to sit around and wait for our dude, and we're going to speak with Sebastian. Now, Sebastian is going to have a very cool story about learning Crucio, but it's going to take us a little bit of time to get over there and a couple of puzzles as well. But no worries, I'll walk you through it right here, right now. Now, the first puzzle that you want to have is to open up the door. Now, after you finish speaking with Ominous, you're going to convince him to open up the secret passage, but it's kind of locked and you have to figure out what you need to do. So you, Sebastian and Ominous will figure out how to open the door. In order to open the door, there will be these three different pillars that you need to light with fire. So open up all three of those pillars by lighting them up consecutively. And if you do it in the correct amount of time, which is one, two, three, boom, 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 hit them with that fire, it's going to open up this door. Now from here, you want to walk down and we're going to have some more things that we have to do. First, use Reparo to repair this. And now you're going to have a nice little cutscene. Open up the door and there's going to be some more puzzles now. Use Revealio. You're going to highlight a couple of things. One is going to be some torches that we're just going to use so we can see these symbols that we have under this snake statue. We need to line up these symbols to match the door in order to open it up. So right here we have a little circle with little lines of circles around here, kind of look like a moon. So we're going to go ahead and do that and match that up with the bottom symbol, which was like a snake in an infinity symbol. And voila, just like that, you open up the door. Now, we need to repeat this process a few more times in order to complete this quest and to learn Crucio. So, use Revealio. It'll show you the doors, right? And if you use Revealio or if you use Illumino, so you can see the symbols. That one right there is going to be like kind of like a bull crossed out and what I would say looks like a slanted A and a slash on top. I don't know. They look kind of weird, but, you know, you get the gist of how things are going to work. We need to line up the symbols on the door with the snake statue. You just have to find a snake statue. For this one, it's right here. Pretty simple, easy to do. Not too much running around and trying to figure it out. But the next one can be a little confusing, but hey, that's what these videos are for. Use your light and light up that door with Revealio. You're gonna have a nice, what I like to call a uh, cherry. Turn sideways. Head over here to the next Slytherin rock. I'm gonna use that Cherry turns sideways into three triple triangles together to open up the door. Oh, bam, just like that, we're inside. Now, once you're inside, make your way into here. And here is where things get interesting. You are about to learn an unforgivable sin. And the only way you can progress and get out of this part is by using it either on yourself or on your friend Sebastian. Now you have a couple of dialogue chests. You can say you very well don't want to learn the curse, which is kind of weird. You went all the way through this mission and not learn the curse. Or you can learn a curse and you can cast it on yourself or use a curse and cast it on him. I said, I want to learn the curse and I'm casting it on you. So that's what we did. We just learned Crucial and I blasted Sebastian. Or you can you know, have him blast you. Don't know why you would do that, but hey, totally up to you. Now the Crucial curse will shoot out that red electricity and open up the door. And just like that, you pretty much are done. Explore, get your loot, and you are done with this part of the quest, and you're done with this unforgivable sin called Crucio. Now, there are many more that we're going to get, and as soon as I'll get those unlocked, I'll upload that video and 
and show you exactly what you need to do. But for right now, that's pretty much going for the video. I hope you truly enjoyed it. As always, if you are new to the channel, how you doing? And welcome. Don't forget to subscribe right here at Carpool Gamer. Upload a wide variety of videos, range from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news, and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.